What's happening, YouTube? I already got it on, honey. I pushed the play. You guys, happy Sunday. In the background, you're going to hear the washer, uh, the dryer. <laughs> But of course, it's your girls. It's your, your ladies. Nail. Ooh, and D. Secret is here. D is right there waving, huh? It's been a crazy weekend, y'all, because of school for Prince William County Schools. It's been back to school shopping. It's been getting hairdos. It's been getting this, that, and the third. This chick here is tired, y'all. Um, but I'm about to make some lasagna. These are washed. I just gotta cut off the ends. But of course, before I get into the video, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can see your favorite ladies post. <laughs> and I am going to proceed with what I'm doing. Do you wanna say hi to the people? Uh, show them your dreads. Mm -hmm. She got her dreads yesterday. We went to um, three advanced. freaking hours. Yeah, it took three sat hours. In the, sat in the chair for three hours. She was annoyed. I was. But now she, but now she know a dread process is but like why the same. Three hours. Oh, my credit card. When Delhi does it, it doesn't take three hours. She know the dreading process. Like the dreading process is a is a little like. <gasps> Extensions. No, this one's gonna be yours. The dread getting your hair dread is just like getting your hair done with extensions. It's a process. Yeah. It ain't gonna just be wham bam. Yeah. Thank you, bam. It's gonna be a process. But um, yeah, you guys. So we've been school shopping. Right now, what I'm doing is dicing these, dicing the celery. Cause like I said, I'm making lasagna today. I was gonna go live, but um, I don't feel no, like going it's live. Okay. We don't have to do that. Secret talking on the phone with her friend. Yeah. As if I want to hear their conversations. <laughs> I'm pretty surprised they took me back. Taking too long. I'm not dicing them down too small, cause as you all know, once you start cooking vegetables, it softens on there. Oh, while they're cooking, I only have a little bit of olive oil, but in this case, I'm going to use the Kerrygold uh, garlic and Parmesan butter. Saute these vegetables. Put them in this bowl here. Come on, y'all. I'm recording right now. He's being mean to me. I may not use all this celery. I don't think I'm gonna need this one. Let me change the lighting. Oh my God. There we go. So, comment down below, you guys. Um, do you guys think lasagna is a Sunday meal? I know last Sunday, I think I made, um, Oh no, we grub tub. We did um KFC last Sunday. But I had asked Secret on Friday. I said, What do you want? Now need to cook this weekend. She wanted lasagna Friday night, but I got off late from work. So I couldn't really do it. So we just did a quick hamburger helper and that turned out good too. The ingredients that I'm using are not all out, but I'm using um, 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 um. <laughs> I'm using ground turkey and mix it with the rest of the Italian sausage that I got in there. They say two flavors is better than one, so why not? 
You, although you guys may be thinking that's a lot of celery, it can never be too much vegetables. That's how I look at it. It do look like it's a lot of celery. Look for me this evening. I, you guys, I forgot to get oil. I forgot to get garlic. I forgot to get minced garlic. Mm, you know what I was thinking? Oil right here. Mm. Got oil right here. Uh, but there's nothing for me. Eh. Uh, I know I'm gonna taste the vegetables with the Kerrygold. This right here will be enough. Garlic. She don't think it will, but this will be. Actually, the meat is going to produce its own oil. I don't need as much of it. So, I'm going to rinse off this green onion. Look, this one's yours. This one's yours. This one's mine. Oh, my camera. My camera looks big. Oh, yeah. This one's yours. The peel and peel it and you guys know that scallion any vegetable any vegetables that you use is optional some people and myself may use red green yellow peppers in this case, I'm just using all green because that's what I have in my fridge. And, you know, we did go to Walmart this morning, but I was only there for school supplies. And I didn't want to go overboard and get all this extra if we already have something that we can use that will benefit the meal at home. So I said, look, we'll just use what we got here before it go bad. It's gonna be flavorful anyway. Bing bing, because what I cook is always flavorful. Don't play with me, don't play with me. Don't need no more of that. <clears throat> Save this. Send that. Tired the weekend go by so fast. I wanted to rest today. Onion. Why not? It ain't gonna be too oniony. It ain't gonna be too oniony. Plus, I ain't gonna even use this whole thing. I just honestly, you guys, we're moving soon, so I just need to get rid of some of this stuff. That's been in the fridge that we don't need. We ain't gonna need none of this part because it's bad. Why not toss it? I was also looking on Facebook just now, you guys. Make sure y'all follow my Facebook. Uh, information that will be on the link down below but i was just looking on facebook how people are saying things about um blue ivy going to school i guess they're tired of seeing her performing with her mom while her mom's on tour y'all leave blue ivy alone leave her alone let that baby look let that baby do what she loves doing the best Leave her alone. At least she's doing something productive and making money. Shit. She ain't tired of nothing. She with her mom, you know? I would be doing that too. But it was just like people in this one group. Because I do, you guys on Facebook, you can join these groups if you if all relate. So I joined this group because I can relate to some of the things that they talk about. And I don't want to put it out there because I don't know if they follow me here on my channel. But um, it, yes, it's one group. I love it. 
so funny. The group is so funny. But <laughs> they just keep saying they try to see in Blue Ivy and, you know, performing with her mom. And I'm a huge Beyonce fan. So when I see Beyonce, I expect to see Blue. They got all the vegetables. But yeah, so they going on her saying, why don't she let her mom do that? Why don't she sit down somewhere? Look, that baby making money and probably get, making more money than the ones that got something to say. Hello. Let that baby do what she do the best. People always talking. Let these people live. These people work hard for what they doing. Beyonce got her daughter walking in her footsteps. And she, and it was probably her daughter's choice to walk in her mama's footsteps. Who wouldn't want to walk in their mama's footsteps? I know I have with my cooking. Because I sure got this cooking and braiding hair from my mama. So I'm going to get the butter. Love, in a few minutes, I need you to grate the um, mozzarella cheese. You guys, I put this in my lasagna sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. What I normally like to do with this, I let it sit out, get room temperature. So that way, so that way, I got a little stain. Oh, that's right. It's when I have down here. So that way, whenever I make the lasagna, it's easy to steer with the um, ricotta cheese. I normally mix it all together with one egg. This ricotta and one egg, mix it all so I can layer it on each layer. But let it sit out. Um, for your information, let this sit out, get room, a little room temperature, let it get a little soft. So that way it won't be so hard to mix whenever you go to mix it with your lasagna. I'm gonna let that sit right there. I'm going there with this. This is some good butter, y'all. Some good butter. Almost three dollars for one stick, but it's worth it. It's garlic and herb butter. Y'all should be familiar with it. I ain't getting the whole thing of it though, because it's like five dollars. But this is what I'm gonna use to saute my vegetables. About one fourth, right there. I'm gonna use that much and just cook it on low. I'm gonna save as much as I can, y'all. I've done use this on three meals so far. I save as I go, sir. You don't need much. You do not need much to accomplish what needs to be accomplished. Um, it's my favorite word. Um, so. Next, I mean, I'm gonna let this butter melt. Let that melt a little bit. Uh, dump these vegetables on in there. I'm gonna dice up my tomato because I normally mix tomatoes with it too.
pie, you guys. So I have my tomato here. I used some the other day. I have ground turkey and the rest of my sausage. Um, Italian sausage. I'm gonna mix it in with the pot with the onions and the celery and the scallions. Mix it all together. This. So we have the spinach that I'll be incorporating into the sauce and a tomato that I'll be incorporating into the sauce, making it so yummy, you guys. Don't knock it till you try it with the spinach. This spinach, it brings a lot of flavor. Matter of fact, you can't even taste the spinach. It dissolves inside the sauce. It's really good. Very good. Definitely try it, you guys. Y'all see all this oil build up that's coming from the um, ground turkey and or the um, Italian sausage? Make sure y'all drain that. I used to keep my oils. I used to keep it because, you know, the pasta needs a little bit of juiciness. But now I have to drain the oil because y'all know if it's sticking to the meat like this, it's sticking to our insides. So now I have to drain it. <laughs> yeah, back when I, in my 20s, I kept the oil. Even on up until a couple weeks ago, I would keep it. But yeah, it's best to drain it. So let me go ahead and stir some more. Oh, I got some ginger. And I just squeezed out some fresh lemon in this cup here. See that ginger at the bottom? I'm going to add two more of these. Because I need me some lemon and ginger to knock this cold out. Like I said, I started a new job. I have to suck in their germs in order for my body to become immune. Where is my honey? Hold on, y'all. Squeeze some honey in there. All right, you guys. So what I'm going to do now is bite this tomato because I'm going to add it in with the spaghetti sauce inside the pot. Sometimes I would get the canned tomatoes. In this case, since this one was already here, I'm using this one. So I'm gonna dice. I know y'all can hear the water bubbling for the pasta. And just dice them up. Watch your fingers. Don't be cutting all crazy like me. I cut crazy. So I try to hurry up and rush the process. Okay, put that in there, 
I'm going to wash this off. for the pasta. Alright. <clears throat> Here, hold on. Okay, so I've never used Campbell's tomato soup in my lasagna before, so this is the first time. Videos in the past that I've posted where I've made lasagna either on a vlog or through my shorts video, I never used this. So we're going to see firsthand how we, you know, do in this lasagna. I'm sure it's still going to be good because it's not really soup based at first. You guys know if you've ever used this, of course, duh, I know you guys have. Um, but you know you have to add water. After dumping this out, you're supposed to fill it up with water and that becomes the soup. So in this case, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to use this to aid in using another spaghetti sauce because I only got one. So luckily I had this in my cabinet. So... I'm just going to add this and see how that goes. It's all tomato, so. Mmm, that smells good. It takes me back to my Chef Boyardee days. <laughs> so I'm going to stare this in and incorporate it all together, and we're going to see the turnout. Taste the sauce. Taste a little bit. Bomb. Mm. Mm. So good. Mm. Mm -mm. All right, you guys. So, as you can see, this is why I said to leave this out, let it get room temperature. So it'll be easily mashable. Not only am I going to use the cream cheese, I'm also going to use, let me discard this tomato sauce, paper towel, and the ones I use to wipe up around. Always keep paper towels handy. Take one egg. You get your ricotta. Now these are my ingredients. You guys may do differently. There's tomato sauce on here, but it's okay because I'm gonna incorporate it all together. And it's easily mashable. And just stir it all in. Try not to do it like messy because you wanna avoid all the spills. <laughs> I packed up my whisk, so I don't have my whisk with me. Let me stir it all in. Let me mix it all together. Give me a second. If you guys want to season your um, mixture, you get a paper towel. <laughs> Wipe off my hand. Anytime you guys want to season your mixture, feel free to put in it what you want to put in it. Season it to your liking. In my case, I'm gonna just do parsley, pepper, and um, maybe a little bit of Italian. Just the parsley. Italian. The oven is already been preheated on 350. The cream cheese didn't get soft all the way, but it's okay. You just keep mashing. You know, cream cheese has the hard consistency. So you just keep mashing. 
and then put your lasagna together. Okay, I'm gonna leave this here because I need that paper towel to wipe my hands off in the end. All right. So. Okay, you guys, so, so far I did noodles, mixture, Italian cheese. Now I'm about to go back in with some more noodles. Some of these noodles are fugly looking, but oh well. They've dried together, got stuck together. I'm going to try to use all these noodles. This is a deep pan, so all these noodles should fit. So I do noodles. Then the mixture, I'm going to use the rest here. I don't need it on no more layers, so this should be good enough. Flatten it out like this flatten it work it all over the noodles if y'all can see from the angle that I have you guys positioned there you go just like that try to flatten it if you have to uh, the noodle to get the sauce over it Don't need no more of that. Then we go with the Italian. Then with the sauce. Too much sauce. Not enough sauce. I gotta clean this stove off. I know wherever we move, I wanna make sure the stove is black because I make a lot of spills happen. So you guys can't even really see the spinach shape. See that? So I hope y'all dissolves. I just want to incorporate healthy with carbs. <laughs> okay, just like that. Like so, like that. Working on them edges. Get them edges. Get them edges, y'all. Get them edges. This noodle will not listen. Okay. Try to use the rest of these noodles. And then I'll be back. Secret are making these for dessert. She made them last time, y'all, and they were good. So we eat those for dessert. The lasagna is almost done. She so don't like to be seen no more. YouTube, tell our supporters why you don't like to be seen on YouTube no more. Look how long her dreads are, y'all. What's up? I think because one of her special friends watches her nah, channel. Nah, it's not that. And she doesn't like to be seen on there a lot anymore. I don't like that. It's just that. Y'all were... Huh? Those dresses, right? Something They're like ugly. She like them, y'all. They're not ugly. They should, My hair is too short. Time. It's too short. That's what it is. At least it's longer than mine. Well, I mean, I ain't got that's that much different. Hair time. Back when I was your age, I did. Wait, because we're supposed to do that challenge. Remember? I got shorts. <laughs> so you want to do a QA and a to ask you a question. All right. Uh... Who's your favorite singer? Nobody. What's your favorite beverage? <laughs> What's that mean? Drinks. Oh. Sprite. What's your favorite movie? I don't got one. What's your favorite Disney character? <laughs> Ariel. Uh, that was Minnie Mouse. 
Ain't she this week? Do you talk about Bruno? No, I don't. Why? No Bruno's ugly. Okay. Everybody's ugly in your opinion. Um, Not everybody. Okay, well, what's your favorite food? Noodles. What kind of noodles? Beef noodles. Beef ramen noodles, you guys. And what's your favorite dinner? Noodles. <laughs> okay. Q and A done with y'all, but we gonna return. We gonna Q and A coming near you. I'm gonna give her a week after a week after she starts school, and I'm gonna do a Q and A, and I'm gonna ask her questions like, "Were your friends nice? Do you like your teachers? Who's your biggest crush?" Uh, all Don't that. ask that. So. Don't ask that. My biggest crush is Steve Harvey. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just, just that. My biggest crush is Steve Harvey. Mm -hmm. She's crazy. Anyway, you guys, so here's the finishing results. Creamy, creamy, burnt on the edges. Yum, yum. Letting it cool down a little bit. This part right here, it folded in because I was trying to stick it under the... <gasps> That's... But anyway, it's done. The lasagna is done. Bada bing, bada boom. I'm gonna let it um, chill a little bit, oh. so that way when I cut it, it'll cut evenly and it won't be all messy. So, mm -hmm. this is dinner. Nope, we're not having no salad. Nope, I didn't make any homemade garlic bread. Nope, I didn't buy any frozen uh, garlic bread. This is what we're gonna have. School is tomorrow, so y'all know it's gonna be an early night. For everybody. For everybody. I don't know about everybody, but y'all better go to bed. Yeah, because y'all got school y tomorrow. little kids. I got school tomorrow, yes, but I don't need to be going to bed. Y'all little kids that are 10 and under need to go to bed. Especially you, Elijah. Yeah, go to bed. Can you watch our channel? No, but okay. go to bed. Anyway, so Be stand up all, all, be stand up all night playing Roblox. That's not good for your mental health. Go to bed now. All right, you Whenever guys. this video is so yeah, it'll be uploaded. Y'all will probably be seeing this video by tomorrow. If not tomorrow, probably Tuesday. Because I have two other ones that I got. So then track. school has already started. Yeah. So Go to bed. Okay. So this is you telling them on the night of this posting, right? Okay. Yeah. What? I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Tonight is Sunday. Well, today is Sunday. I'm telling you guys Sunday to go to bed because we got school tomorrow. But if this is uploaded Tuesday, we already had school, but still go to bed because you got school tomorrow. There you go. All right. That's on the period. And we're going to go ahead and cut Ooh. this and let you guys see that cheese pull. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is how it's cutting, you guys. Look at that. Look at. Ooh. I can't even. Ooh. Hold on. I'm going to have to. Hold on, y'all. Because y'all, because y'all, do y'all see that? Look at that. Look at that pool. Look at that pool. Look at that pool. Look at that cheese pool. <laughs> Donnie, who would you want to share a shower with? Share who with? A shower. A shower with? Celebrity wise or anybody? Just, uh, D. Okay. Don't ask me. No. Oh. Shadows in my room. <laughs> <laughs> 